Marriage is an act of faith and a personal commitment, as well as a moral and physical union between two people. We have a lot in common, but at the same time, we're totally different people, so it keeps things interesting. We're both huge animal lovers. We actually have the same breed of dog. We have Labrador Retrievers, now we have two of them. And like, we can, you know, go out and have a great time together and, and party, and then we can have a Sunday where we're on the couch watching Netflix all day, and as long as we're together, we enjoy it. I met Whitney in downtown Orlando, kind of ironic. We've uh, had mutual friends for years, but we never knew each other. We never ran into each other. And then uh, I was just out getting ready to go to Orlando Magic Games, stopped at a bar, went inside, saw some of my friends, and she was there and made an introduction and just couldn't take my eyes off of her. And she was talking to some other people, and I walked in, interrupted them, uh, and asked for a phone number, and went from there. Dearly beloved, we are gathered together today in the sight of God and the faces of this company to join together this man and this woman in holy matrimony. I first knew I was going to marry her probably within, it sounds funny, but three to four weeks of getting together. Well, the proposal was uh, very sneaky. Like weeks before, he had planned to go to the UFC fight. It was the first one in Orlando when they came to Amway. So I had planned a girls' day. I gave my tickets up and uh, invited uh, my family, some friends, her family. We just kind of staged everything at Lake Eola. We made Rose Petal's uh, heart at the steps of Lake Eola. And her dad contacted her and uh, basically said, she's, he's in, in the area, come meet him. My sister and I uh, got downtown. We were on our way to dinner and then I see my dad. And then I look across the street and there's Jacob standing there with roses and everybody are all around. And her dad passed her off to me, gave me, uh, gave me her hand and I walked with her from the steps down to the lake. And we walk over and, and like he had rose petals out and the heart shape and all of our close friends and family were there, which was great. And he got down on one knee. And I was probably only down there for a half a second because she was already saying yes as I went down onto my knee. So. Like it's stuff that like girls like fairy tale dream, you know, you write down like this would be amazing, this could happen, you know, never think it would, but even a part of it, but the whole thing together was fantastic. And so by the power vested in me, by the state of Florida and Almighty God, I now pronounce you man and wife, and may your days be good and long upon the earth. You may kiss the bride. Well, marriage to me, to Whitney, is everything. It doesn't even scare me or make me nervous at all. Like, I've been ready for this ever since I, the first time I told him I loved him. She's just one of those people that everyone wants to be around, including myself. So I was lucky enough to be the one that uh, snagged her forever. <laughs>